Hello everyone, and this is the finished product, our A10 made from a little glider. This is actually isn't from Little Glider. I got this from Home Bargains, $1.99. Um, and yeah, the little quadcopter inside, that cost me uh, $7.99. So this little A10, little radar controlled A10, has cost me less than 10 English sterling pounds. So yeah, um, go, go to those shops, buy your own, and you know, make your own. Go make something. Um, last thing that we need to do now is to get this thing to fly, so let's just plug our battery in. And uh, we've got beautiful, you need really, really calm winds. Um, I brought it out last night and it was like 11 mile an hour winds, and it was just hovering there, it was just sort of, you know, bouncing around in the wind. Here we are, and it looks like we've got two to three mile an hour winds today, so let's, uh, you know, let's try it in zero winds. There's our gear, so we've just got the flight controller in there, you need to use your back two motors. Uh, the flight control is actually upside down, so you're going to need to switch your propellers around if you do that the same as me. Battery on the centre of gravity. Oh, nice. There we go. <clears throat> I didn't know she did a nice little slot for your battery. Yeah. That's nice, that. So you need to put your flight controller all the way up. What I might actually do is stick a flight controller, make a slot in there, and I'm going to stick it vertically, because... Um, because it's a flight controller, it's at its pitch attitude. That's not right. That's better. Right, you ready? Oh, and there's also a problem because it's the back two motors. If I want to go left, I've got to push right, and if I want to go right, I've got to push left. Ready? Mm-hmm. See, getting right there. When the nose is pitching up, we're getting more throttle, and when the nose is pitching down, we're getting less throttle. Yeah, we don't want that at all. What we want is the very opposite of that. So when the nose pitches down, the flight controller adds more power, so that pitches the nose up, and when the nose is pitching up too much, it drops the power so that it stays. So basically, we want to get it to fly in level. Ready? Yep. Nice one. <laughs> it's all this is just trimming the airplane. So we can also put a little bit of dihedral in the wings. That'll give us some natural stability. Full circuit, then. <laughs> Will you exercise to a gentle hand launch then? Ah! Low level flying! Kids <laughs> come further and further away. Heat of the motor to remelt the hot glue. Ah, feel that motor. Well, you know, trial and error, trial and error. This is what this whole channel is about. We make things, we build stuff, you know, we try, and if we don't succeed, we try and try again. So, thank you very much for joining us here at RC Robotics. If you like this content, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, it is just up there. And if you'd like to see any more of my videos, I'll pop one down here in the corner and I'll pop another just down here. Thank you very much, and I will see you guys soon. Bye bye.